Rahman Rahim. Assalamu alaikum and uh, good uh, morning. So now we continue our practical work to practical work number two. So the title of this practical work is No Load Performance for Short Line. Okay? So learning outcome in this experiment. Number one, we will measure the single phase and three phase sending and uh, sending uh, and voltage. Number two, we'll, uh, we measure the single phase and three phase, the receiving voltage. And number three is we calculate the voltage regulation of short line model. Before we start our experiment, so all the students need to identify the equipment listed in this lab sheet. Right? So make sure all the students, when, when you watch this, this video, uh, uh, you already have uh, this lab sheet. All right. So we go to the number one. Number one is three phase bench power supply. So this is a three phase bench power supply. We'll give the uh, power to the system. Number two is a power circuit breaker. Uh, this, one, this is a power circuit breaker. Uh, the function for protect our uh, circuit, our system. Number three is a three-phase transformer. Uh, this is a three-phase transformer. Uh, we'll step up or step down our voltage and uh, our power. And then number four is transmission line model. So this is a transmission line model. So when we talking about the transmission, so we have a let's say this is a this is a transmission line model. So we have a sending part. This part is a sending part. And then we transfer the energy, and this part is receiving, right? So this we call the transmission line model. And the, four, the uh, number five uh, is electrical meter. In this case, we uh, not use this electrical meter, but we will use the external multimeter. How to use this multimeter? Suppose all the students know how to use the this meter for example uh all right uh come uh your name oh, sorry uh, daniel. okay come daniel so how so this is uh, our student so how to set this multimeter uh to measure uh, how to measure uh put the uh, voltage all right uh, this is a uh, alternating current uh, okay so make sure all the students set the range is 750 volt and uh, alternating current. Okay, before we start to measure. Right. Thank you, Daniel. Okay, now all the students already know the part of equipment, the part of component. So we go to the next part is uh, curing. This is a theoretical. In 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 the in our class, we already discussed how to get this formula. How to get the Vs equal to Vr plus Zir. So supposed to be a student already know how this formula is uh, derived. Okay. So we go to the next part is a procedure. This is very important. According to the uh, procedure, number one, complete the circuit diagram in Figure two. So all the student need. Uh, sorry. Uh, yeah. Okay, this is a figure 2. In your lab sheet, already have this one, right? So, task student need to complete this diagram. So, how to complete this diagram? Okay, now, focus here. You just... Uh, uh, okay. This uh, connection already... Uh, so our team already uh, connect this circuit. Just follow the the connection. Let's say the A1 uh, sambungkan kepada stop two, and then A2 go to the neutral, and just follow this uh, connection. Alright. So berdasarkan kepada prosedur nombor satu, we need to complete the circuit diagram in Figure two. How to complete? This diagram, okay. Untuk bahagian power circuit breaker, sambungan ini memang dah 
kita pasang siap-siap Jadi semua student just follow sahaja macam mana dia punya sambungan Ya yeah? Sambungan daripada macam saya cakap tadi A1 pergi kepada point number 2 Just follow saja. Sekarang saya nak tunjukkan Macam mana kita nak menyambung yang part yang lain Alright So ready guys Alright uh, Daniel and